I'm good. I think it's really nice. my channel so I'm so excited guys if you're new to this channel and you haven't subscribed yet please do so and watch all my videos so if you notice I'm wearing something on my <laughs> head <laughs> yes because I'm gonna uh, share with you guys another product that I have discovered and it has so many great and fabulous benefits that it can give us not only onto our face but also to our body oh wow so i don't know i tried this jeju island i jeju island ice <laughs> so guys i'm going to compare this product jeju aloe ice to this product jeju aloe gel all right, so all from the face shop. So I'm gonna give a review about these two products. And as you can remember, I have already featured this one in my previous video. And but the main feature for today's video, guys, is the Jeju Aloe Gel. I have here two a uh, brand, brand brands brands <laughs> this is from the face shop yes i am this is from the face shop and this is from minisu this one cost me only sixty three thousand vnd while the face shop is free because you know my friend went there this afternoon and we discovered that jeju alo eyes is still on sale buy two and get one free ayan so she paid 150 151 per top she got two so that's around almost 300 yes and she got this free and she asked me to use it <laughs> so I'm gonna try this one and one more thing one friend also asked me to do a review about this one so let's try and guys you know what's the good thing about this one is that it gives us a lot of benefits not only for our face but also for our body especially for a woman like me like us when we're on our 40s especially when you have given birth already oh my god it's so exciting so i i want to try this one guys okay yes yeah, so i'll give you 10 tips on the benefits of the jeju aloe ice and what does it contain okay so so what are the benefits of jeju aloe gel first and foremost if you notice this is in color green okay and the top is also green it's different packaging from the jeju aloe eyes ayan diba okay guys so it uh this product has a fresh soothing gel nature collection it is uh formulated with 99 percent aloe vera leaf extract from jeju island to soothe and moisturize the skin ayan so this can be used for various purposes like moisturizing, soothing your skin burn, and what else. So I'll give you 10 tips on how to use this Jeju Aloe Gel. Let's open this one. Yes, it's sealed with the plastic. So alam niyo talaga, this is not an imitation. You can all you can buy this at the face shop all all around the world and tingnan natin guys what is inside and how does it hmm it has a good smell yes but i think the texture is really watery and clear yeah it's so clear yeah like water it's a gel but it has really good smell like 
aloe vera smell and so this aloe gel jeju aloe gel has a lot of usage like facial pack moisturizer sunburn relief so i'm going to mention 10 ways on how to use this one and really exciting because it's i think it would really help uh, women like us you know so guys the first thing is this product let me see oh my god oh my god okay the first one we should do is it's used as a moisturizing pack all you need to do is apply it onto your face yeah so that's the reason why i have this headband i don't know how you call this one but yeah so you apply um how do you call that generous amount into your face and leave it there for 15 minutes let the product sits in for at least 10 to 15 minutes yes all right so you can use it as a pack moisturizing pack still very wet you can see that of course you have to apply this one after cleaning your face or washing it with washing your face with your favorite cleansing oil all right okay so while waiting for a few minutes i'll share with you the second tip is that um, it is used as moisturizer so you can add an oil your favorite oil to this product select your favorite oil like for example um serum and there's a very good recommendation for what oil to use in mixing with jeju aloe gel so number one is jujuba oil you can also mix it with organ oil or uh, what rose water oil another easy one maybe easy to find is the coconut oil or the vitamin e serum yeah after leaving this product onto your skin for 15 minutes 10 or 15 minutes you can spread the product slowly into your neck like this all right so it's really watery it's different from the this product that i've used this one it quickly dries but mm, jeju aloe gel takes quite a few minutes or quite a long time to you know to dissolve or to dry yeah and so guys another exciting thing that i've discovered about this product is that you can put it onto your eyes like this all you need to do is get yeah pad of cotton pad of cotton when you use it as an eye patch make sure that you cool the product first for a few minutes or when you know soak the cotton with the product and then when it's ready you can put it onto your eyes so just make sure that the product doesn't get, get into your eyes and onto the cotton here oh my god but you have to close your eyes when you do this guys i mean when you put it onto your eyes you have to close your eyes and leave it there for a few minutes uh, according to my research yes it will give you a cooling effect so all you need to do is soak a pair of soak a pair of cotton pad and place it on the eye area of your hmm, place it on the eye area and when it's ready you can get a, fee, a little amount or generous amount and soak so like this oh my god <laughs> oh my god so you can <laughs> oh no it's so cool wow hmm i'm feeling good i think it's really nice hmm but it it was really amazing for me to discover that it can be used as you know eye patch hmm, maybe when your eyes are tired 
you can put this one before going to sleep probably five minutes ten minutes hmm wow yeah okay so try it at home guys can I still open my eyes? Baka nag ano na siya. Dikit. My God. Yeah. Ayan. Hmm. Pwede pala siya. No, sa eyes. Okay. So, that's it. Try it at home. Oh my goodness. Ah, soak pala. You have to soak a pair of cotton. Wow, magastos to ah. Yes, guys. So, if you feel some tingling effect or maybe burning sensation to your eye area, you have to wash it with water right away. Okay, let me see if there is a burning sensation. Yes, there's none so far. Yes. Alright. Ayan. Tip number four. This is also really good for men. If you have sensitive skin, you can use this after shaving. And what is the most exciting thing about this product is that I discovered that I can use it if you have a lot of scars like for parents or mothers like us. You know, you have given birth already or for those single women who have, you know... Uh, scars, uh, I mean stretch marks, you can apply this onto your body, the affected area, with your favorite oil, for example, uh, olive oil, natural olive oil, um, avocado oil, what else? Mm. So, either of that too. All you need to do is you get one is to three. So, one ratio one portion of this aloe gel I'm gonna mix it one teaspoon or one tablespoon jeju aloe gel and three teaspoon or three tablespoon of olive oil yeah so and then you're gonna spread it onto your stretch marks and let's see. I haven't tried it yet. Tonight, I will try it and let me see. I have an olive oil there, but I I'm sorry. I think I cannot show you my stretch marks. <laughs> so, I'll just give you an update about this. If ever, maybe after a week or two, whatever is the result of putting this product, mixing it with oil, so tip number seven, it can be used as a makeup base. Try not in tomorrow, okay? So I'm gonna add, uh, <laughs> mixing your BB cream, your favorite BB cream. I, I got, my friend gave it to me. It's from the face shop. And I'm gonna mix it with Jeju aloe gel. Let's see if it's going to give us a very dewy, glowy, according to the research that I have, it will give you the glowy and dewy look. All you need to do is mix one is to one or one is to two, depending on your mixture. So we're going to try tomorrow, guys. And let the mixture will result into more whipped texture that would optimal for dehydrated and dry skin. Ayan, yeah, so let's try guys, no? And then number eight usage is it can be used as a nail essence. Yeah, so if you want, oh, tingnan mo yung mga kuku ko, talagang kuku nang nagtatabaho. Let's see. Hirap talaga na walong helper, no? So you lahat. Yeah. Okay, so let's try. Let's put it on see our fingers like this one. Yeah, to our nails. Wow. Let's see if we have a good effect. Kasi nakita ko sa picture shiny siya. Tingnan natin kung shiny rin yung hands ko. Gumanda ba siya? Wow. 
may, meron yatang effect. Well, ang bilis, no? Ang bilis. It's very fast! Then, try nyo lang, guys. Let's see. But, you know, if there are some uh, negative effects, side effects onto your skin, please stop use, using the product right away. And if you feel some tingling sensation, itchiness, you quickly wash your face. Yes? But so far, la pa naman siyang negative effect except that it's a little sticky. A little sticky? Nako, mababanda ko ng face shop nito. <laughs> Ayan, so, and then, yeah, so it will give you a conditioned healthy nails with vitality. No? Miss, maganda siya pala. It will give us a vitality. It will give a conditioned nails with vitality. So using before applying manicure, uh, pedicure, or nail polish will result in more vivid colors. Ayan. So if you want to have a very nice color to your nail polish, then you apply this before putting the nail polish. Number nine usage is the hair treatment. Yeah, I, I, when I was young, I know I used to put aloe vera onto, you, onto my hair, my scalp. Yes, my mother taught me that. And we have plant, but, um, you know, they said it can help you make your, it can make your hair grow thicker, shinier, healthier, all the good benefits. Yes, but I don't know if my hair has that luster, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Anyways, according to the research, hmm, aloe vera facilitates hair growth. So apply aloe vera at the ends of your hair. Pwede kaya kung mag-apply ngayon. And it will treat split ends. Or you can massage it to your scalp, rise, to moisturize both hair and scalp. Leave it for 15 minutes and rinse it with water. So tomorrow, guys, I'm going to try it before I'll take a bath in the morning. Okay, so keep posted for that. The last but not the least is tip number 10 or usage number 10. So it can be used as hair gel. Talaga. Maybe for some men. It's good to use this one for hair gel. Maybe you can try this one. I'm going to tell my son to try this one. <laughs> Let's see if he likes it. Mm. Ayan. According to the research, it will leave your hair shiny, keeping it in place while it is moisturizing all at once. Adiba. So guys, anyways... As we grow older, we want to keep up with the world because we are still alive and kicking. So we must also continue learning, beautifying ourselves spiritually, mentally, physically. Um, that's all about this product. And keep posted, guys. Tomorrow, I'll be making another update about the Jeju Aloe Eyes. But for Jeju Aloe Gel... Maybe after a week, I'll be posting an update regarding the, you know, I'm excited about if it's gonna remove my stretch marks. Yeah, so, because I have lots of stretch marks due to childbirth, adiba. Ayan mga guys, so, thank you so much. I think this buy one take one get one free offer is still available all over the world at only at the face shop okay fyi mm -hmm. watching all my videos and for subscribing to my channel we are already 116 i hope you i'm gonna ask your friends and families to subscribe and watch our Kikai Vlogs.
Alright, thank you so much guys. Enjoy nyo lang buhay. Life is too short to be wasted. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Please don't forget to click and subscribe.